Hello there. This is a little, like, mod spotlight, I guess. Um, it's more like an AI scripting thing that I discovered. Well, I guess people know about it already, but essentially it's called VCOM AI. And what this does is adds new depth to the AI. Now, for the longest time I've had an AI thing called FFIS. Now... It basically made the AI dance when you're shooting at them. And while that's entertaining, it's not very realistic because we're not playing a Matrix game. Um, so I decided to do a little showcase of it um, myself. Um, I've only looked at it for literally 10 minutes. So <laughs> here's what I get my first impressions of, essentially. I'm going to go ahead and put in two... Um, two... Um, squads here. I'm going to put in two fire teams. Waiting. One on this side of town and one on this side of town. And what you already see is instead of the standard um, arrow thing, well this time it looks like an actual arrow, but that's besides the point. It's a different kind of thing for a different situation. A smaller group doesn't need to be like that. I would consider a diamond a better situation, but I'm not a squad leader. I am one of these guys. In fact, I'm usually a rifleman or an AT, so I'd be this guy. But, um, I still notice a lot of cool things. Once I get a situation I really get impressed, I will probably delete the other AI and show you what happens. So let's go ahead and get these guys to engage in each other. Wanna Give this guy that. Good to go on killing him. And good to go on killing him. We'll just observe this. Um, I'll probably speed this up until something interesting really happens. Because right now they're all just trying to get the jump on each other. So, without further ado, the movements of AI. Oh, well, that's not the right key. And I'll turn this back on. Right here. This is some pretty interesting stuff here. Now, I've noticed something a little weird about the AI movements. Um, VCOM decides to give them really weird locations. But, I don't see anything wrong with it. I haven't done anything stupid. But as you can see, the AI tends to split up a lot more um, using the ter the area um, yeah, normally. Um, Blue Force seems to be taking up positions near buildings and walls. Uh, for is maintaining somewhat of a formation while continuing down the road. Uh, we're going to see some interaction here, so I'm going to switch to the normal map. So, as you can tell already, Blue Four guy here has garrisoned a building, along with just him right now. But um, garrisoning a building, that's not normally happening uh, in normal. And you can also tell that they're actually talking to each other, not making decisions through telepath. We're going to get a con an interaction right here. He sees him. He's running away. He saw someone over here. He took him out. He's down. Um, we got another one. Gonna attack him. Let's see if he gets the jump on him. He did a sidestep there. Now he's running away. Um, to see if he can get a better position, I believe. He's gonna come around this corner a bit. Yep, and he's running away so he can get the jump on him if he's good, but he's taking his time looking in the wrong direction, but let's see what these guys are up to over here. Firing in at this guy right here. Or was that him who fired? Because I thought it was Left. 
two odd four and it looks like three blue four. And the squad leaders This guy comes around the corner. Pretty sure these two are gonna light him up. Or wait. He's switching sides. I think he just friendly fired to be honest. He popped a smoke. FFIS has been known to have enemies pop smokes. But I don't really see any difference in <laughs> Oh, here's something interesting. I'm gonna delete this guy and this guy. Um, although I prefer it to be blue for, we have a injured man. He's on the civilian side, so he doesn't get automatically killed. Um, he will wake up at some point and regain consciousness. But um, to speed that up, we'll give him a little friend. Let's give him a kind of lifesaver. Let's smell this kind of in the way. What this guy will first do is he'll immediately go and try to help him out. <laughs> I've never seen this before in AI, um, but I might be wrong into thinking this is something new in FFIS, but I haven't seen that yet in FFIS. So in the middle of a firefight, they might actually drag him to cover, but um, I don't know. Now let's see them in an interaction with me, uh, a player. AI versus AI can be boring at some points. What is this guy doing? I'm gonna delete him. So I'm gonna put myself in here. Uh, put a couple guys, actually. Put a small fire team here, and I'll give them go down this road, and I'll spawn here. So I'm gonna go into MCC and teleport over to here. Now this is something I haven't done before: is actually face them in combat myself. So we're going to see how this goes through with just the default gear that I get when I spawn. So I'm not in my comfort zone, I'll just tell you that. I'm going to go ahead and take up a position in this building. So I get the drop. Ah, uh, there's a bush. I'm going to go behind the buildings. If I can. Because I am facing a lot of people compared to just by my, when I'm by myself. Let's see if we can get up on the second floor of this building. Or no, this will do just fine. I can hear him already. Oh, you see that? They were they went into a building, which I haven't never seen before. Now that they know I'm here, they're gonna try and get the jump on me at some point. And I am taken down. Not really a good idea to be playing by yourself. Um, I'm not technically dead, but I don't have any CLSs nearby to get me up, so I am, eh, dead. Um, which is, in itself, pretty interesting. But, I haven't set up a spawn point yet, so I need to get into the building. Get through here. Go on, go on. Oh, shoot. I was trying to do something stupid. I should have stayed in the building. I haven't set up a spawn point, so I'm just going to spawn where I was. Okay, okay. Let's pretend none of that ever happened, and I didn't become an idiot. Oh, I threw up smoke, so... See, he's down, but he's not dead, I think. Try and get across here. Gosh, I don't usually play like this. I usually play with a 
squad. I don't see any more. But I do have a better gun. Can I peek up over this? I did see someone walk into a building. I don't know if they've garrisoned it by themselves. Oh, snake. Uh, I see two injured. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and test something out real quick. I'm gonna put down a CLS and introduce myself into that environment of them trying, getting shot at while I'm trying to treat. Let's see what happens here. Let's see what he does first. Oh, <laughs> he gets him up quick, I'll tell you that. Spawn. I might spawn in the building. Hopefully I do. Yes. Okay. So if they have a CLS, they're going to get picked up quickly if they're down. Um, and in certain situations, that means that you're going to want to target their CLS just as they're trying to target yours. Which is very cool. Um, let's see if I can get a drop on him from up here. Got him. Another down. Okay, so they're there, there. Oh, that's a bad grenade. Oh. That was a bad grenade. So let's. And <laughs> see, the thing about Arma is playing like this with 30 frames at the very least. Is the most beautiful thing for me because on multiplayer I get less than 20 to 10 frames. Uh, does this go straight through the building? No, it doesn't. We should get. I'm gonna go through this little area here. And from what I can tell, there should be two guys left standing. everything to be honest. Um, yep, that's everyone. I took out everybody dying a couple times. Well, you're not usually going to do the best on your own, um, but um, now I wonder how they respond to um, artillery. I've actually wondered that myself the entire time of this video. So I'm going to go ahead and give them some artillery to deal with. Will they take cover? Um, or will they just stand there like idiots? So oh here. God. Now, there is something I saw on the thing. You can't give them this specific thing, but if I double click here, or get these guys to... Um, hold. And then add. Oh, that is beautiful. They split up, and I believe they start garrisoning buildings. They, they, so they split up. And what? What does that do? I don't get it. Well, 
that's the beauty of uh MCC though. Got these guys. Cool. Uh, let's go ahead and spawn in some dudes for me. Um, reinforcements. Uh, garrison. And I'm giving this a light garrison. So the garrison in these buildings. Because these aren't buildings that are normally garrisoned. So, whatever. I'm gonna do some illegal war actions in artillery of this church. Um, let's give them mortar to deal with. You gonna deal with anything? You gonna die? Yeah, you guys are gonna die. It's okay. No? Let's see what happens here. So, once one goes down, they start running. So they don't help that guy out, though. You gonna do anything for him if he's in your group? So, it, it doesn't need to be a CLS for them to pick each other up. But, let's see if you forgot about... He's going back to what he was doing. <laughs> Missile strike? Ah, let's do it. Get down. Oh, looks like that guy found me. <laughs> Alright, well that concludes my video for right now. And, uh, hope you had a nice day, everyone. It's a little bit of a different kind of video I've done, and uh, at least it's a video, I gotta say. And uh, I'm glad you guys joined me with it, and hopefully <laughs> Task Force Mamba will consider this a good mod addition to their things. Um, I'm going to do something a little bit crazy, see how it goes. Because I haven't seen uh, vehicle utilization, utilization, I can't even say words today. I'm going to delete everything real quick. Man, is that guy still dry flying around? Yeah, once it's spawned in Zeus, he doesn't just disappear. I guess he does. Right. Removed. Okay, time to do that stupid thing I talked about. Where am I? Okay, here we go. Let's get an air. Kajman. And we're gonna do one, two, three, four, so we got six of these guys. Now, little zoo shortcut I learned. Boom, grouped up. Let's get these guys in the air. And let's put them in a column. You guys can do it. Whatever. Um, 
Your goal is to, of course. Wait, where am I? Kill me! Woohoo! <laughs> Let's watch this monstrosity come happen. I would, uh, literally in game, I would be in terrible scare mode. Take a front porch view of this. Oh my gosh. I've seen more, to be honest. That's only five. But five is just enough to scare any person. Especially when they're Kajmans. See if I can take a pot shot at them. Boom! Boom! Oh gosh. Air relentless. Oh wow. <laughs> I've had some fun guys. Hope you did too. See you later. This has been Zayef Gaming, and he just crashed. I think they shot each other. Are they all out of the air? Or did he just, like, literally kind of crash, you know? Oh, I crashed, but I kind of didn't. Nope, he's proper messed up. Well, <laughs> looks like I've acquired some gear if I can get myself a toolkit. Well, hope everybody had a good day. Bye-bye.